Perfect. No outflow. God damn it! I hate that it's night. It, that it's daytime. Not daytime yet. I'm gonna kill all these zombie bastards. All right. Let, let there be light. Let's see, I've got the most of those, but it looks of it. There. Now the brachiosaur cannot break out the door. Four of those, and I believe that gets me all that I need in those, so... Hey! Yeah, that's all I need, because I need only two of those. Can I shift-click this? Yes, I can. Wonderful. Two node stabilizers. And now I need to <laughs> combine that with normal arcade stone. Um, so, that there. Hey, go away. Outlook. That there. Steel and a primal charm, which I need to make a balance shard for. Which I may already have. Hopefully. Apparently not. There's no way I only have one air shard left. And that requires an air shard. And I only have one? There's no way. There's a stack of air shards right here. Two, three, four, five, six. No, I was missing one. You know what I was just reminded of for some odd reason? What? That scene in Ted when Liam Neeson comes up and Ted's working the um, uh, checkout line and he's like, I've learned that these are supposedly strictly for children. So, I want to purchase these. And he's holding a box of tricks. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember that. Like, I remember the commercial for it. It's a really awkward moment. And he's like, I won't, I won't forget what you've done here today. And Ted's like, I kind of prefer you do. Oh, that's right, because Ted ain't the one buying them. Uh, yeah, it's Liam Neeson buying them. And give me that. That's everything I need to make the node destabilizer. Uh, I need a Tesseract now, which is not a problem, but something I do need. So let me make the Primal Charm. Not a problem. And node destabilizer. What's missing? I don't have steel. I forgot to grab the steel. I hear someone's music. And still hearing it. I don't know why you're talking to me. It's gas music. I know it is. Always yeah. her. This thing is, she's not even in the room it's playing in. It's because she plays it all the time. What? Your music. What music? We was able to hear some music of yours. I think it's only two that I need. You know, it sucks. I probably have to actually go and recharge my wand after all of this. 
yeah, because I'm missing some major components. Node, uh, it's a destabilizer I'm trying to make. What am I missing? A functional brain. See that does work. Maybe it was maybe it was because whenever I hit it in any uh, it hit it differently. All right, so now I have a destabilizer, a stabilizer. I also need the other node thingy now, though. But you you shouldn't have this in there. I don't know how you still have shit in there. Oh, are you sad, Mr. Brachiosaur? Sad that you can't break my wall? Oh, well, that's just too goddamn bad. You <laughs> so. <sighs> okay, so. Okay, so Niter is three and three if I'm correct, right? Yes, three, three, three. I didn't do three torches. That's what I did wrong. Yeah, and now I need to empty that. All right, uh, what else do I need here? Okay, so I need four redstone blocks, two iron, and a comparator. Just give that time to go away. Uh, baby, I need you to come here for just... What? She needs a smidgen of your time. Hold on. Alright, I will be right back, y'all. And we are back. So, uh, hold on. No, 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 we're not back. Don't listen to this fuckhead crackpot. We're not back. What kind of world do you think this is where we're back? We're always back, because we're back in black. No. No, just, just now. Hey, look, I actually made all of the components with one charge of my wand, which is now completely depleted. Wow, Charlie. And Maybe I can't go and now. capture a node. Oh, wow, you completely and totally fucked up. <sighs> yeah, you just have no idea. However, the Deep Dark is going to have a great time after I'm done. I need to go empty my inventory. We and only have one jungle wood sapling. Yeah, that makes sense. In the, in the ME system. Uh-huh. Okay. Mm so I'm going to have to transmute some. Very possible, yes. Why? Whenever we're next to a jungle, just go cut down the fucking jungle. Because I'm trying to make a sustainable source of jungle wood trees for my dinosaurs. Let's see, where are the fern seeds? Perfect. Shit. I made that and I, I used my last node stabilizer, so now I have to uh, make another. <laughs> Charlie, maybe you should come outside and see the amazing work I've done. Hold on. Let me make another node stabilizer. So I need one gold, two quartz, and another niter. No, screw your stabilizers. No nodes shall be 
stable here. We must all must be unstable and chaotic. <laughs> uh, Stability? No, that's crazy. Oh, Charlie, guess what? What? I found a blue pill. Okay. A what? A blue pill. Oh, no, I gave you that blue pill. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No, I never took it. Then what happened to the one I threw on the ground at your feet just a second ago? You did? Yes, I did. He was in here. It's all on film. What am I looking at now? Uh, hold on. I'm putting some stuff away. Okay, well, that'll be over here until you're ready. Well, fine, then. If you're just going to be a miss impatient Nancy, come over here. Oh, fuck you. I'm already over here now. Okay. I absolutely hate the fact that, um, any odd doesn't work inside of the, um, arcane crafting table. I, I gotta make some lighter first. Damn it, I forgot the glowstone. Yeah, you're always forgetting something. Uh, that's actually pretty bad that I forgot the glowstone. Go. Don't get slowness now. Damn it, I lost the torch. Node that is not spell node that says need. What the fuck am I trying to spell? Your name. You're not good at it. I mean, you're not very far off from that. So, gold, niter, the bricks. I only made one block of block of quartz. That that's where I went wrong was the block of quartz. Know what I need to do, Alex? Jump off a cliff? Well, besides that, I need to run the ME system over to my magic shack. Yeah. It's the only place that don't have power or an ME system. No, there's another place. Where? I'll, I'll just let your primitive brain think it over. Where am I meeting you at? I never said you were meeting me anywhere. Motherfuckers! What? Stuff keeps... I'm confused. Hmm. I get a nausea for like a second, like when those creepers are blowing up on me. They weren't blowing up on you. What were they then? They were blowing up on me. Why was I getting the effect? Because you were close. That was enough terse answers for you? Nope. Oh, okay. Don't expect any more answers. I didn't know we even had answers. Well, we did. Then you showed up. Alright. Well, I'm going to the deep dark. Well, that's just magical. Maybe you'll drown. Nah, uh, I'm coming here to grab this Tesseract.
Alright. So. I need to keep torches. Or actually, you know what? Fuck that shit. On. No, because it's good to collect as many aspects as possible. Oh, but still, then this means I have to go back down there and... I, I don't know. Um, fuck it, I'm going this way. I'm just going to set up the node back here. No, because this is actually only going to fill it up with um, Perdicio or Terra doing it like this. But there are ores over here still. Alright, so, I should only need the Tezzerak down here, right there, should be sending and receiving power, everything else, right? Yeah. Then I need the destabilizer, which is this right here. I guess I need a torch, so it turns off, and then I put the node on top. And then that will eat the world. You you don't sound like this is a huge deal, Alex. It's not. But it's an absolutely tremendous deal. You're just manipulating a node, Charlie. That's nothing. Yeah, you're right. I am manipulating a node. Because node Anything manipulation is my friend. Anything short of a vortex attenuator is really not that impressive. Um, well, we can't do the vortex attenuator until I really have a nearly infinite source of node anyway. Yeah. So, I need to make a, 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 a centiviz node, or whatever the fuck it's called. A centiviz node, or whatever. I think it's called, like, an unstable node, or a activated node, something like that. It just lets out little lightning sparks. Oh yeah, by the way, another side effect of the vortex attenuator is that it sends out lightning bolts that strike anything nearby and also lets out poisonous flux goo and gas. Okay. Doesn't a torch technically put out a high level of redstone? A redstone torch? No, not a torch, a lever. Uh, no clue. Because I, I thought putting a lever next to this thing would cut it off. But it's not. That's right, I get cobblestone back, not normal stone. I guess not, I guess the thing is just going to eat power forever. Until I get back here. Maybe it is disabled right now, and I just don't know. Because maybe it spins no matter what, and whenever I add the torch, maybe that right there causes it to um, actually destabilize the node. Alright. Now I need to go and capture myself a node.
there. What? Nothing. None of your concern. Oh, it's all my concern now. No, it's not. Don't pretend it's your concern. <laughs> no, concerns are for normal people. You're... you're Charlie. It's kind of like being a Morty. Ouch. A Morty? Yeah, yeah. Alright, fine then. Fuck you. I hope the T-Rex eats you. Yeah, it's not a T-Rex. Do you just build shit at random? Like, there's no planning on where it's gonna go or anything? Actually, I planned it to be out here for a while now. I do like the double iron doors. Like... Like, this is just like... Like, I can understand maybe if, like, we didn't have the smeltery... Oh, well, not that. Like, with it being here, if we didn't have first the tar pit here and then your blood altar on the other fucking side. Yeah. Like, it feels out of place. Well, it wasn't my first idea, but this seems like the best location. I actually thought the jungle itself would have been the better location. Well, the reason why the jungle itself would have made a good location is the Brachiosaur would tear down all the trees. Not to mention, I already have something in the jungle. But you know what it means? Now that the jungle itself is not the location? What? Chop, 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 chop. What? Oh, you could cut down the jungle? Yeah, cut down, cut down the trees. Give us our front lawn back. I mean, I figured we would have you know, cut down the trees just to do the dinosaurs there anyway and have paths in, in, like, in between them all and all that. Nah, nah, that's that's way too much work, especially given how little benefits we get from them. From what the paths or the dinosaurs? From the dinosaurs. I know, but cutting down the trees gives us wood. Exactly. Lots of wood. So collect the wood, motherfucker. Well, no, well, no. What I'm saying is, we we could have put the dinosaurs there, and whenever we cut down the trees to make room for the pins, we would have collected a lot of wood. Stop questioning me. I question everything you do. That's my job. Fuck you. Like, why the fuck did you make the flamingos pink, Alex? I didn't make them. I knew you didn't make them. You built the mod pack, you bitch. You made them. The fuck you talking about, bitch? Oh, hell no. Do not put that piss poor work <laughs> on me. We all know this is your shit. You piece of hoe. Well, no wonder it works better than what it did five days ago. Because I've started working on it. <laughs> you all know he's full of shit. Yeah, this has been a long and grinding process, and we still ain't done. Yeah, it's true. I've got this shit to do garbage. still. This coding is garbage. Like, I've got shit to do. Alex has got some things to still help me with in the quest book. I have to code in some recipes. We gotta code in a quest book. Uh, well, the coding in the quest book isn't too hard. It's just a long process to do, and it's really grinding. Yeah, it took like two hours, I think, for us to finish up one whole quest book series. Yeah, just one tree. And then after after we get all the trees done, I've actually got to go back again and literally tie all the trees together. And when I say tie together, I mean like you have to have certain quests to unlock another tree. Not like, you know, add quests to your things to tie them to the others. Well, we have a front lawn again. Good. I absolutely love the rivers. I, I've been so long since I've seen a river in Minecraft, but I absolutely love them. I don't know if I want this node or that red node I found earlier. Like this node's cool, but the red node is red and this one is black. I know I hate node hunting in the middle of the um um tundra though. But no, it makes perfect sense to um, build all this here. 
next thing, I'm going to cut down these four trees that are surrounding um, the bookshelves. Uh-huh. And we just need to take these golems and... No, no, don't, don't cut down the trees surrounding the bookshelves. I have those there for decoration. Like, I like them there. They're shit. Yeah, but it, it gives an enchanting feel. They're very shit. How? They just don't go with anything there. They're next to a junk, a fucking jungle. Kind of. Not anymore. Motherfucker, don't cut them down. It's kind of light to protest now. Did I just end up where I think I did? I did, motherfucker. I can't hear you, Cassie. That's because she isn't saying anything. I heard her say something. I don't know if she turned off her mic or what. If I said, why are you fucking your What? I said, why are you fucking your mother? I'm not. You just, you just said you were, Charlie. I ended all the way back up at mine and Cassie's original house. That's where I ended up. Motherfucker. It spawned an angry zombie right on me. This one's spawning a lot of angry zombies, actually. You know, now that I actually have a forest where I can, you know, keep these large herbivores and they can't get out because obsidian bricks are tougher than iron blocks. Um, Told you, you used the reinforced obsidian from Ender IO. I mean, from, um, Charlie, it's it's not worth that kind of expense. I mean, they're not like expensive, expensive. I mean, these obsidian bricks were literally dirt cheap. <laughs> All right. And they're also condensable. I, I think I think what we have maybe too. Here's the first tar pit I ever found. The one I filled up with lava. Cause fuck you, Alex. Is it actually tar? Is the block called tar? It was. I just literally covered it up with lava and now it don't spawn tar really. I'm planning on changing where we put the tar pit. I, it, oh shit. If you can move it earlier than later that would be amazing. Because it looks like crap where it is. Especially if you put your dinosaurs there. I need to put some torches inside. Am I actually retrogening new chunks still? I think I am. Actually, no, no, no. I don't need torches. No, no. I need something stronger than torches. Why is that? Well, I don't want the Brachiosaur breaking them. Uh, put some lanterns up on the walls. I guess it don't work in the center, though, does it? No, it don't. Uh, can it break things like leaf blocks that are, like, under the ground and shit? Uh, yeah. So, how does it break it when it steps on it is what I don't understand. Okay, Charlie. Imagine there's the real-world Brachiosaur standing right in front of you. Shut the fuck up, Alex. It weighs about 20 tons. And it steps on something. That thing explodes. Violently, from a whole bunch of weight. <laughs> so every time he steps on glass, it will explode. Uh, well, technically, yeah, he, he breaks glass whenever he steps on it. I mean, he's able to break quite a lot of things. <laughs> 